Welcome back to Dare Stage, uh, Prepare to Dance Edition. <laughs> so we beat the Copper Demon. We we actually did it, and um, we got way less souls than I wanted, but I don't care. I'm just oh, that felt good. That boss was bullshit, by the way. Um, we got the key to the, the underground. Which I'm gonna guess is here. Like that that's gotta be it. Uh I I, I feel like I'm levitating now. I after I, after what happened at the end of last episode, uh I basically I mean you probably heard how I just left the room, but I, I just I just laid down on the kitchen floor and just I was just I, I just laid there for a bit, just taking in the feeling of having defeated that Fucking douche. Oh, I felt good. I, I I thought I was dead. I thought for certain I was very, very dead. Um, there was like not a single part of my body that thought like, yeah, you're you're done with this. Like, I was completely Completely. How did you get the spawn? I haven't been to a fi to, to to a bonfire. Um, like I, I I was I was practically ready to um do the whole um like the whole song and dance with like m well running b back here and fight from the start. Only now without any um, throwable items, which would have made things harder. I should point out. Um, the damage we got from that, while not much. Da what the fuck? But I looked for you, you weren't there! That could have killed me! Oh my god, what if that had killed me? That would have been so humiliating. I mean, it was humiliating enough that I actually got hit by it, but... I looked for him when I walked down the stairs and I just didn't see him, so I figured, oh well... I Yes, he's not there. Um, <laughs> wow. Holy shit. Um, yeah. <sighs> Thank you. I don't know. Um, we should probably level up, but I'm gonna use um, some souls. Because we have... Um, we have these. Um... Oh, that didn't give, give as much as I wanted to. What more I'm to give, but that's fine. Um, and we actually we have an item. We have um, the divine ember, which can make our spear a cooler spear if we go to a blacksmith. Um, now the closest blacksmith I know is in Londo, where where we're not meant to go. Uh, and I don't know if he can forge divine weapons. Um, so I might just head back to... Mm. Well, we'll see. We'll see what happens in the underground, and if we need to, then we just go there. Okay, so... Um, explanation. And death equipment load. We need more endurance, because we've been bleeding, and our equipment load is fucked. But we also need more vitality, because our health is not that great. So I don't know. Maybe Vitality this this uh, level, and then Endurance the next one. Actually, maybe we should get Vitality up to 20, and then we can start um, working with that. Okay, so we want 7.8 souls. Man, we would have had two more level ups if uh, we hadn't lost our first big um, retrieval. That kind of hurts. I don't have any humanity to spare. I could, I mean, I could eat some humanity, uh, but I don't want to do that when I enter in this area the first time because what if I die immediately? That that would just be, you know, sad. I wonder if there will be a bonfire at the start of the underground though, like you know, like I thought would be really good. Uh, I, it it seemed like a really good placement for a bonfire, you know, before I fought the boss. But now that I fought the boss, it's like oh. 
Well, I mean, if there's a bonfire now, that's, that's still good, but I, I need it less now. Uh, you know, I got I was so frustrated with the copper demon that I kept fucking up here all the time, and the shitty like lock-on system kept had me constantly falling down here. Oh, is that a fire bomb? Oh, it's a hollow warrior armor. There was something dropped here, though. Maybe that's a fire bomb. No, that's a short sword. God damn! They just want some fire bombs. Do you have any fire bombs? I really wish you could see what items are before you uh, loot the bodies. That'd be really nice. I find this game really easy to grind in, to be honest. Because like, there's so many one-hit and en one-kill enemies that still give you decent uh, souls. Close by bonfires, and you can literally just run back and forth for like a couple of minutes and have a level up. I mean, I did that in Underberg when I first had trouble. Um, but like... Even now, I could do that. Man, I spent like fucking... I don't know how long the total footage of uh, the Copper Demon fight is. I edited down a lot. Um, so I wanted to mainly just be the fights and not just my retracing. Although I did keep some of the rambling I did. Um, I'm recording this before I've edited it all, fin all done. I, I hope I kept my... Uh, my ninja Gaiden and all Shadow Warriors uh, rambling. Cause I, I thought that was interesting. Um, yeah, you probably want, want to get a good shield back, don't we? And not this crap one. We'll fix that after we kill this guy. Yeah, don't like the shield. Missed my good shield. Let's fix that. Uh, Unequip. Night shield. There we go. Much better. See, so yeah, I'm still having my morning tea that I meant. I, I hope I. I think I mentioned at least right before. Um, um, I started the, the copper demon fight today. Uh, it's always good to have tea while playing games. I did it, yeah, so did I. I actually was going to leave a message, but I wasn't, um... I wasn't human while, when I defeated the Copper Demon, so I couldn't. Mm-hmm. Well, this looks dreadfully boring. Uh, hollows, more hollows, a lot of hollows. This reminds me of the um, the church, actually, a bit. All right, let's see how much damage you take. Oh, yeah, one hit. Depths. It's a cool shark game called Depth. It's like a um, multiplayer horror game where one where one or two players are sharks and the others are divers. Like, it, it's very much reliant on um, stalker paranoia and um, jump scares, so if you're not into those, then it might not be for you, but, but, but I, I thought it was a really cool concept. I haven't actually played it myself, because I don't really... I tend to not buy multiplayer games much, because I don't really play them. Uh, I don't really have people to play with that often. Uh, but... Um, I watched like gameplay videos, videos of it, and I was actually really impressed by it. Like the jump scares got to me even even in video form, because they since since they're actually like player, um, I mean they, they happen because of what the shark do. <laughs> so like, the, it's actually uh, like you you can actually it's actually hard to predict because it's not directed, it's not scripted. It's oh shit, it just fell down. It's like that. <laughs> it's like something just happens. And uh, that that that's quite cool. Hello. You have a bag on your head, and you have more health than the other guys.
I mean, you're not very good at fighting, though, I gotta say. Oh, a thousand souls! Thank you! I wonder who that was. I mean, obviously a normal enemy, because <laughs> there's no way that was a mini boss or anything, but. Yeah. I wonder how common they will be. You must help me. Where are you? Oh, you! Hey! Thank you. I would have been a supper without you. Been eating the line. Who's supper? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, dearly. It's I'm cool. Alexia. Protagonist from Assassin's Creed. With Greg's fault. I will not forget my debt to you. This is great. I'll see you at the uh, filing shrine, I guess. Oh, hello there. I'm fine, thanks to you. Yeah. I mean, I just like rolling into barrels, so it's a good thing you were stuck in a barrel. You know, you could have just rolled out of it. There's, these barrels are very fragile. Oh, hold on, hold on. There we go. Is that it? Nope. Boxes. Ah, much better. This is what it should look like. I've been doing this ever since uh, Dem since I first played Demon Souls. I just love. Well, actually, I've been doing it since any game that has boxes you can destroy in them. It's just so much fun to just boom into everything. Well, there's nothing else here, huh? I guess this was like the kitchen area that the slaughter butcher guy was in. Without me, uh, he would have been her supper. Who could her be? Probably the boss of the area. Good fight a female demon, are we? Okay. Interesting. Well, this just goes down. I want to look back up. Ah. Okay. I'm hearing something. That's like a throwing knife or something. Or like a whip? Whatever it is, I'm gonna go here. Get out, 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 the fuck out! Go, what's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? Oh shit! What's that? What's that? Can you follow me up? It looks like it. Holy shit! I'm gonna firebomb the fuck out of you. Oh, I don't have, I don't have a firebomb. Oh fuck. Um, do I? Do I? Do I have anything like that? No, I don't. Well, uh, I'm gonna, gonna slowly walk down and stab the fuck out of you. Where's the? Where is it? Seriously, what the fuck is that? That's like the scariest enemy I've seen in games in a while. It's actually like... Well, until it pops up like that, it just becomes a blob. But like, in this mode, it's actually like... Completely alien and unintelligible. Like, that's some cosmic horror shit. And I like my cosmic horror shit. More like Alone in the Dark Souls. I would totally play a Lovecraftian in Dark Souls. By the way. I mean, I guess it's, it, it always feels a bit awkward when you're supposed to fight Lovecraftian and stuff, but like, fuck it, I'll... I'll abide. And you know what? It would be pretty cool to have a sanity stat. Let's see what you can do with that. I'm sure you can think of something cool. Maybe sanity could be instead of humanity and you can regain sanity. Yeah, that'd be really cool. Get from software. Let's talk. If not, I'll just make it myself. When I'm 
better at making games in the future. So I'm guessing it was hanging in the ceiling and I just didn't see it. Okay, so now we know we gotta be careful and look at the ceiling. Okay. Well. Good to know, I guess. Because it can only move in water. Unfortunately, everything here is water. I can't really see either, because like this game does not get, this does, this game doesn't have a good camera. I just want to point that out. I don't see anything right now. Solid ground. Oh yeah, there are tons of them there. None of them here though. I'm gonna walk here first. Oh, we can't get up there, of course. Huh? Did something attack me? It feels like something attacked me. I don't know. Okay, so, um, these things, yeah. I do wonder how much damage I do if I do a heavy attack. Not much. Not much at all. Spear might not be the best weapon for this kind of enemy, to be honest. This might actually be a case where the crossbow, the bow and arrow would be a good idea. So I could shoot them down from the ceiling. But I want, I want the spear for my uh, regular enemies though, so I'm not gonna... I can't equip both right now, so we're just gonna... For now we're gonna play it like this. We'll see what happens. Those are... Two smaller ones, I think? Oh, fuck's sake. I hate the whole, like, level, like, level in terms of, like, above and below thing. The height thing. It's so fucking terrible. Like, really? I, oh, yeah, like, that didn't hit, for example. At least that hit. I don't want to get too close either, because they will fucking swallow me. These were scary when they were just like a red puddle in water though. Like, I don't really care for the whole slimy part. That's just kind of boring. When I, couldn't, when I couldn't tell what it was, that was creepy. Now it's just like, oh, okay, so it's... It's, like it's, a, sli it's a slime ball. Okay. Are there more up there? Yeah, there are more up there. At least I'm getting a lot of souls, so when I go back to uh, when I get when I get to a bonfire, I can level up again probably. It's time there's three of them at once. Okay. I mean, they're not really hard so much as intimidating because of the whole swallow you thing. Uh, as long as I keep my distance and the attack actually hit, this is going just fine, actually. Like, I'm guessing that was it trying to swallow me. It seems pretty slow with that as well. Which is good, I guess otherwise it would be kind of overpowered. Oh. Okay. What's my backstab again? Oh yeah, that. Okay, it's the same one. Oh, well, this is exciting. Maybe not the best idea for a common enemy, these guys. 
Maybe like make them a bit faster, have them be like a very rare enemy would be more fun. Because then it would actually be kind of difficult to um, evade. And it wouldn't take forever to just go through three of them like this because you felt like putting six of them in one hallway. Or maybe I'm, maybe I'm under leveled, what do I know? They don't even drop anything, like, wow. Okay, level for last ones at least. Hello! <laughs> oh no, the boss of the hallway. Um, well, I can go down there, I can go in here. I'll go in here first. It's locked. Okay, I'm not going in there. Huh. Oh dear! What's that? That's a giant fucking rat! Are you kidding me? This game has giant rats? The most overused fucking fantasy RPG trope and it's a... It's that fucking massive? That's gotta, that's gotta be like a joke about the giant rat stuff, right? Seems like there's a hole we can drop in there. Might be good to know. I'm not gonna drop immediately though, because I wanna check out what's here. Small rats! Lots of small rats. And more slime balls. Yeah, uh, you know what? I'm gonna drop down the hole. Oh shit. What's that gonna make me fight you? I don't wanna fight you. You look scary. Um. What I'm doing. Oh, it's a ladder. Oh, in that case, I can actually get up. Like seriously. Like no, this is not okay. Like that's yes, not fucking okay. Are you blind, friend? You have a fucking axe in your eye. Holy fuck. Like no, not okay. Not okay, not okay. Uh, okay. Door. Are you for. Uh, can I, like, stab you? <gasps> no? I can't? This would be a safe position to do. Oh, I can! Maybe I can kill it from here. No, no, I learned this lesson and ran away. Yeah. Yeah, you do that. You better run. So I can fight the small rats, they'll probably kill me. I have one humanity. It's cool. If only I had a bonfire. Okay, so there are four rats? Maybe five? No, that's five rats. And one... Maybe two slime balls. Um, these rats look more dangerous than the last rats we fought, so, um... Might wanna fight those first and figure out if we're able to defeat them. Slime ball doesn't seem to mind. So we can, we, can, we can move above the water, which means we're safe. It's running away from us. Okay, no, these, are, these die easily. This, might, this seems to be just almost the same rats, just slightly more health. Interesting. I was expecting more, to be honest. Not that I don't mind not having to fight the toughest enemies alive, but... Oh my god. Fucking douchebag, I was having a drink. Um, but, um, you know, it's this game. I was expecting the worst, you know? Oh, a great axe. Like the one in the eye of the giant rat. Is that the girl or the, the female boss that they were hinting about earlier, maybe? The one who was going to eat the, um... Was it Laurentius? For uh, dinner? Oh, that can't be. It'd be really lame if that was a giant. That's probably just a special enemy. Okay, slime ball. It's you and me, again. Well, I know you're an enemy. Yes. Oh. Never mind. Can I do that with all these?
I guess not. Or maybe yes. Oh. Yeah. Icky. Oh, that's a small rat. It's a really small rat. These look like doors, though, and that kind of bugs me. <laughs> I was going to break that box, not you! Wait, this is the path to the large rat. Oh dear. That's not good. Are we sure we can break these? Yeah, we can't, that's weird. Oh my fucking god, there's a fucking rat family down here. And more slime balls. I'm not fond of either, I just want to point that out, for the record. At least, okay, so this does not lead to the large rat. I'm going to guess that the key on the corpse there leads to the large rat. Okay, regain stamina. Stab a rat in the back. Stab a rat in the back. Back up. Regain stamina. Stab a rat in the face. Regain stamina. Stab a rat in the side. Destroy giant bulb of slime. Get the sewer chamber key. Called it. Um, let's see what's over here then. I wonder if there's BS sort an enemy popping out of somewhere. Ooh, down there could be interesting. So far, it's a soldier named the soldier. Fair enough. Oh, that's a fog door. Great. Let's hear them. We can jump over that if we just time a good jump. Let's fail doing that. Or not. Oh, come the fuck on. Stop running away. Oh, wait. Wait a second. Okay, good. Okay. Is that another fog door? Or has he just not rendered properly yet? Oh, he just hadn't rendered. <laughs> oh, I think he just walked over a hole. Yeah, I did. Oh, great. A slime ball. I can't see it because I'm, the, the rat is stuck in my body. Wonderful. <laughs> okay. Really would like a bonfire right now. You know. Just saying. Oh great, I'm the sorcerer. I love sorcerers. They're my favorite enemy I fought once. Wait, that's another giant rat. Oh no, you're enhancing your strength or something, aren't you? Yep, you just made the the uh, you just made those rats harder to kill. You are a douchebag. You know that? Not a very smart one, though. Like, you're dead now. So, um... Was it worth it? Anyone else wanna have a go? Dead. 
dead. I'll do you later. Oh. Humanity, nice. Come on then. Oh, ooh. Ferocious. And dead. Seriously? A bonfire, please? Maybe this message is imminent bonfire. Please be imminent bonfire. Be wary of left. Oh, so it's not a bit, not at all that. Where am I? Oh, that's another fog door. That's another fog door. There are two fog doors. Um, we need to be wary of left. Oh, we get some more of these. I was going to joke about that, but I guess that was actually the case. Oh, hello. Ooh, nice. We still haven't found a fucking bonfire. Is there no bonfire in the depths? I don't want to go into a fucking fog door without knowing I can safely return when I die. Because I will die. It's been a single boss. Yeah, okay, okay. I, I did defeat the Slidem Demon on my first try, but apart from that, it's been a single thing like I actually defeated uh, <laughs> on the first go. I don't think so. Okay, uh, there was a path up here there as well, wasn't there? Yep. Oh wait, this is the giant rat. This is the giant rat's room. At least that solves the question of whether or not the giant rat is the uh, boss. It's not. Want to fight it? I mean, of course I do. Come here. Maybe he's weak to the great axe. That's a that's a fucking large leap, but fuck. Okay, <laughs> okay. Um, what we run for that thing over there and then run back. So I don't see any doors or anything. So it's not like we would be walking anywhere, probably. Nice! Oh fuck, we're cornered! Ouch! We're cornered! And we're dead! Well, that was fucking useless. Uh, great. Brilliant, actually. Um, well, uh, well, fuck. Fuck!